It's an art form that Anj Muhorake first learned when she was just five years old at a refugee camp. We started to, eat, to learn how to weave with this. Each basket is hand woven with dyed sisal wrapped around fragrant sweet grass. This is the traditional basket. The craft came back into her life many years later when she moved to the United States. I remember when I was uh, at airport, when I was about to come here, my mom gave me the um, the sweet grass and sisal plant fibers, and she asked me to keep remembering our culture. She started weaving to pass the time, and that blossomed into a business. I make my own um, design in bowls. With help now coming from thousands of miles away. Uh, I, have a, I have a group of women back home. They help me to find the supplies. Then they send them here. Me and my mom, we weave. And there's other women here and men help us to weave. Muhorake says it's extremely important for her to give back. Back home, uh, a lot of women knows how to weave, but they don't make money, enough money from this. Her goal is to change that with these beautiful baskets. The balls, they are easy to make for me because they are my favorite ones. And it's already working. Some of them are uh, building the houses. They didn't have the homes. I still want to work hard to help more, even the whole to work in the whole country. Mm -hmm. That's my dream.